Okay, first things first. Plaid fleece scarves are out and we know so many things can be done with them so definitely take a peek into your store because once the plaid is out they kind of sell out super fast some other really cute bits here as well today i always find it so interesting i was just at the other dollar tree and filmed a ton for you guys there and none of this stuff was there so it's amazing like these baking supplies really do come in handy if you're having to do some baking so keep your eyes peeled because it looks like there's some fun items at different stores and look at all the socks here the other location didn't have the variety either now they could have been sold out but I highly doubt it Are little shot glasses and they're glass this is a great find so i have some that actually have little light ups they change they have led lights but they're plastic i much prefer having glass shot glasses do you see these the little camper there's two campers per set. A little deer. Super cute. Both owls are very nice, but which one do you prefer? I think the white one is prettier. These are two different shades of blue, so this one is darker. It's kind of hard to see, but in real life you can tell the difference. Some really nice, simple white ornaments here, so if you're wanting to accent your tree, the white always kind of pops as well. These are new, or at least new to us here. The metal, you can take them apart and use them into other decor for sure. Look at these nice silver ones. the famous wings are back so these are going to sell out really quickly as well for you who do not have your mind in the gutter there's the rose the gold and the white ones oh these are new scented sticks i'm gonna open them and smell them These are perfect for troll heads and you know the little purple minions, the little guys, or you can use them as troll hair if you wanted to do a colorful one. Lots of costumes still available. There's a cape here, 
the ladybug, the bumblebee, the wings are in the kids. Who likes these candies? I do not. This is either I think a love or a hate. But these M&Ms on the other hand are delicious. Look at that, all the little boos are gone. Do you guys remember seeing a ton of little boos on this one here? Ooh, stuffing. This is a nice big box. She really like giving these to the kids on Halloween night and the only reason is it's so dark and hard to see them. Honestly, I'm kind of surprised to see how little we have left here because we were fully stocked just a week ago and now at this store here, it's just, it's looking a little bare when it comes to the ornaments. I think people are buying boxes full. And uh, yeah, there's just like a little bit of this and a little bit of that here. Some stores are fully packed and then other ones are not. Maybe we'll receive more things at this store. These are pretty. Blue and white is really in this year as well. Ah, there's some ornaments up top. The little ball ornaments, perfect for making a wreath. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. I love them. Oh, my boy is way past that stage, but those are the cutest masks ever. And there's capes in the other on the other side. Oh, look at these squishies. These are so popular right now with the kids. Like my they absolutely love squishies. I wonder if this would work in a tent. Does this project well? Just thinking of like girl guide stuff. It's a projector light. Hmm.
nice to actually see the copper or the LED lights a little tiny. There's copper wire or silver wire. Different size here. What are these called? Willow wreaths. Or grapevine wreaths, sorry. Here's some of the new Crafter Square packaging. It's quite pretty, the packaging. I get this sign for every time I leave the office to go to Dollar Tree. So now I've been looking for, uh, not too long ago, I bought a really nice towel that looks like this in gray, but it was huge. And I do regret not buying more because they're all sold out. I can't find any. Yeah, they're really good quality. I don't blame people for buying them. They were a lot nicer. Yeah, what are you going to do? This is a new line here and it is made in Turkey. Has anyone tried it? Does it have a nice sudsy effect? Does it have a nice smell? So in my last shop, I found Tana there. This is such a great product line. So this one's black and shoe polish, of course. Sorry if I'm not explaining it. It is a shoe com company that it's a brand that provides shoe cleaners. Yes, I guess. So there's black and brown. Someone was looking for shoe horns. Here they are. <laughs> I'm going to go down the storage stuff here. I don't typically um, look very closely in this aisle, but I know some of you have been asking me too, so here it is.
Yeah, so it's like this, except purple is not going to really match my home decor, but it was a nice big towel like that. I love these. They have like the non-slip on the out on the bottom surface, the inside surface, and then they sit into one another so you can first see the eyes and the little compartments. One thing you want to make sure you're paying attention to is sizing of things. So, for example, there are these two. They're identical. However, one is massive. The other one is tiny. So, depending on what your needs are, pay attention to sizes because you're going to pay the same price. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do you see these? For those who do use their silhouettes and crickets and personalize, these are really cute, simple tumblers. I am absolutely, usually I don't gravitate toward them. These are cute.
you need to make a little gnome and you need beer, like a fuzzy beard, you can use these if you can't find the eyelash yarn that I've used. I know a lot of you have been using the mop heads as well, so they sell them here at Dollar Tree on their own, these big giant cotton ones. Remember that uh, some of them also come already attached to a, the stick, the mop stick, the broomstick, I'm not sure what you'd call it. Hmm. So this is a Greenbrier brand. Does, does anyone have any insight to these? Are they made in the US? I should probably look a little bit into these treats. These are the, my favorite little mini binders for organizing my stickers. This is a new color because mine are like a, maybe a teal, blue, green. New glue, praying, chop. Doesn't seem like they have the two packs anymore. I would love to know what you're making with these tiny mini wood craft cubes. They're just so cute for ornaments, but I'd love to know what you're making with them. These are new. We used to have a different sanding block, so these look different. 
I love these scissors. I have a couple of them in the house. They do work very well. They're Westcott as well, which is a great brand for a scissor. These are nice and cheerful, very bright neon colors. I'm just looking at these bags and thinking about girl guides. This is the perfect navy blue. And if I can personalize them. All right, so here's some Christmas paper. I am absolutely loving the Hallmark expression paper that they have this year. I don't need wrapping paper. I'm really trying to limit the amount of stuff that's going to be around. These are so cute. They're like squishies, but they turn into cupcakes. The makeup area is a bit scarce today. Um, I know you guys always ask me to film this, but there's not much going on here. Some of the other stores do have a lot more right now. So our aisle here is not very, like the, even the e.l.f. products are not really around here. So. See what's new over here. So one thing I do love about this store is when they have brand name makeup, you'll always find it on this little end unit. So this is something I have to remember to just immediately go to the, the end cap. See here you have your Elf, your Wet n Wild, just a ton of brand name products. So I'm just looking and this Modest line is the same as the other feminine wash. Oh, I hate when people do that. Like, why can't you just put it in the garbage or take it with you? And there's always a garbage bin at the front. This is amazing, just to see all of the numerals, the alphabet, I'm just so happy. This is the first time I'm actually seeing this at our store, so this is so exciting. So I probably bore you, because every time I come in here I share with you how much I love these containers. This one here I have with the lid, they're perfect for organizing all sorts of little things. 
this one here has like a little cubby and it, ha it holds all of my tools on my craft cart. This one holds my embossing powder, so I have a few of them. If you want some ideas, these are in my Alex cabinets, my pull-out drawers. Um, I do share with you guys in my craft room tour how I organize a lot of my craft materials. I absolutely love them because they're clear, so they look so pretty. So again, this line here is kind of newer to us, at least unless it's been redone with the modest. They have like the feminine wipes and the feminine wash and you see the little bath bombs that come in a pack of three. Just gonna see if they have any more of those scrunchies. Made by, how do you pronounce this company? Seuss, oh my goodness. Scunzi, I think it's Scunzi, Scunzi. They had some really cute scrunchies, but it doesn't look like they have any more. These ones are fun. They almost look like a birthday ribbon. These are new, looks like they're all sold out. So for those who like using these little faux lashes, they look they look like a better product almost. I'm not sure, but anyways, I'm gonna check out. I've been here for a long time today. I look forward to sharing a haul with you guys. And until next time, thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.